in a bid to provide urgent and accelerated intervention on the critical sections of the Benin local Jafera Highway. The Renewed Help Administration of the President of Nigeria, His Excellency President Asuajibola Ahmed Tinubu GCFR, has approved the immediate funding of 30 km dualization of three sections of the road to be funded under tax credit scheme by Bua Group. The Honorable Minister of Works, His Excellency Senator Engineer Wednesday David Umahi CON, mailed this known in a meeting with all the contractors handling the Benin Local Jafira Highway and some stakeholders from the area. The Honorable Minister said that the Ministry took some steps to review the texture of the pavement of the project to conform to the new innovation introduced by the Renewed Hope Administration to ensure best standards and durability. According to him, I quote, I first went through the road in September when I went through it, I was very satisfied at BPP and uh, the ministry did very fantastic work. But all I did was to keep the project but review the texture of the pavement. And so we allowed the existing carriageway to be on asphalt and then reviewed the new carriageway to be on concrete. Being satisfied, so we went through the process of notifying the BPP and from there we went to FEC and graciously FEC did approve. And so we are in the process of signing an addendum to the contract. End of quote. Mr. President has approved that Boa Group should do 30 kilometers of the road in three locations, multiplied by two, that is 60 kilometers on tax credit. End of quote. So I went through the road first in September, and when I went through it, I was very satisfied that, you know, BPP and the ministry did very fantastic work. But all I did was to keep the project, but review the texture of uh, the uh, pavement. And so we allowed the existing carriageway to be on uh, asphalt and then reviewed the new uh, carriageway to be on concrete. So being satisfied, so we went through the process of notifying the PP and then from there we went to FEC. And graciously, I think on 16th, you know, FEC uh, approved. And so we are in the process of signing an addendum to the contract. And so I'm going to bend backwards to do what we had said we would not do. Now, when the project has been mobilized, we're not remobilized, but we're going to be remobilizing the contractors after they sign the addendum to collect 30% to fast track, you know, this project. And uh, <laughs> also fast track, you know, our commitment. The Honorable Minister commended Boa Group for their interest to handle the construction of the 30 kilometer carriage way on that task credit scheme and said the intervention was targeted at the critical sections of the road as already isolated when he last visited the Bini Lokoja Road. He stated, and I quote, Let me commend Boa PLC very highly because on their own they had indicated the interest to do about 30 kilometers of the road on task credit. That was one of the reasons I decided to go and revisit the road to know the section they needed to do and also to open the road. So uh, we had to open the road. We appealed to the road transport workers. A work would start Monday the next week. That was 18th. And indeed, we briefed the president and then Senator Adam Sushumale now came with the full weight of his person. End of quote. Uh, you know, PLC very highly because on their own, they had indicated to do about 30 kilometers of the road on that task credit. That was one of the reasons I decided to go and revisit the road and know the second and also to open the road. So we had to open the road. We appealed to the road transport workers that work will start on Monday the next week. That was it. And, uh, you know, indeed, we briefed the president. And then the uh, Senator Adam Oshimone now came with the full weight of his person. And um, I had told the president that we can isolate three sections of the road um, and then uh, you know, do intervention through the poor PLC. And uh, the president, with the also intervention of uh, Senator Adam, um, approved. So Mr. President has approved that poor PLC should do 30 kilometers of the road in three different locations, multiplied by 260 kilometers on that as credit. 
Speaking on behalf of the people of the area, the Senator representing Edo South Senatorial District and Chairman Senate Committee on Interior, Senator Adams Oshemole, praised the determination of the Renewed Hope Administration of Mr. President in changing the socioeconomic narrative of the nation through aggressive road infrastructure transformation and uncommon commitment of the Honorable Minister of Works in achieving the vision of Mr. President on road infrastructure development. The Senator who came in the company of the APC candidate in the Edo State's September 2024 governorship election and uh, Senator representing Edo Central Senatorial District. Senator Monde Obeolo expressed his profound pleasure over the new paradigm in the Federal Ministry of Works, noting that the ministry under Senator Mahi has recorded unprecedented performance in the road infrastructure development within the shortest period of time. He said, and I quote, I was shocked that within 72 hours, this minister did not only hear the word of the president. He packaged what I have seen from the briefing to be a doable and a workable approach to solving a problem that four or five ministers before him could not solve. So I wish to ask us to appreciate his energy, his drive, and his focus, without which we will not be here today. End of quote. And I will show that within 72 hours, this minister did not really have the word of the president. He just packaged what I have seen from the briefing to be a doable, workable approach to solve a problem that four or five ministers before, before him could not solve. Yes. So I wish to ask us to appreciate his energy, his drive, his focus, uh, without which we will not be here today. In their separate remarks, the governorship candidate of APC in Edo, Senator Monde Obeolo, said, Mr. President has rekindled our help just within the short time of our request of the Honorable Minister. Magic has been done. If this is how Nigeria works, everybody will want to come back home. Nobody will want to jump. Ah, end of quote. On his part, the group executive director of Boa Group, Kabiru Rabiu, assured of the commitment of the company in achieving the project within a record time. In his vote of thanks, the Permanent Secretary, Federal Minister of Works, Yakubu Adam Kofaramata PAD, appreciated Mr. President for the new narrative in the Federal Minister of Works, which is made possible by the appointment of a workaholic and highly committed Honorable Minister of Works, signed by Honorable Barrister Oji Uchenna Oji, Special Advisor Media to the Honorable Minister of Works.